it's just design. I see it, I see it, I see it. <laughs> Take one Ooh. more. Nice job. Tails never fails. Oh, Tails never fails. You gotta flip a coin. You got the first pick because we older than them. That doesn't mean I've been here longer than both of you. It's true. Yeah, you're, you, he's, he's almost my age. I forgot. He's, yeah, let it drop. Tails. Yep, get out of here. Yes! Yes! Welcome, everybody, to the 2023 University of Connecticut basketball softball draft. It's actually something we've been doing over the last couple of years. Uh, just a way to bond with the team, um, bond with the coaches. It's become pretty competitive over the last few years. It's a cool thing. We do a draft and, you know, get our players out of their comfort zone a little bit and have some fun. With the first pick, the New Englander select Andrew Hurley of Glastonbury, Connecticut. That's like, that's like Victor and Yamba. It was a lock. I'm here. It was a lock. I'm here, I'm here. You guys are done. They stand no chance. Like, like they better not score more than five runs. All right, lock in. I just got one word, which is domination, because I feel bad for the team we play against tomorrow. We may win by 30, 40. Um, I told the team they, they can't score more than five runs, and I expect at least six home runs from our guys. Um, yeah, that, that team over there, they stand no chance. That's all I got to say. Listen, when you're the biggest kid in the school, probably most of your life, it's pretty easy to be confident. He's ultra confident. Uh, sometimes it's to a fault. He went by 30, they have no he, said this, he said the same thing last year and was sick when he lost. I just like to try to get in the other team's head a lot. Um, you know, I feel like if you try to get them thinking about it, you're you know, just a step ahead of them. But you know, some people are you know, wired differently and they like it. So he's a great guy, he's a great player, great basketball player. I don't know how good he is in softball, but yeah, I mean, he's, he's amazing for us. He's, he's gonna be big and I mean, he's one of our leaders, one of the guys we'll go to. And he has a number next to his name and that's for a reason. For us to reach our goals and for him to reach his personal goals, he's gonna have to be, you know, a double-double guy for us just to start. Person of the year, Time Magazine, vision of the future, breaking on the scene, keep on persevering, never giving up, fate is what you're making now, I don't believe in luck. You know, we're looking at him to pretty much double his production from last year, all across the board, minutes, points, rebounds, overall impact on the game. He's got huge shoes to fill in Adama. We need him to be as dominant as Adama was, or if not, even better but in his own way. He's so versatile. His skill levels at his size and height is rare. He's gonna be our key guy that we go to. Now what's my name? It's one thing to talk about being one of the best big guys in the country, but that means you gotta go out and get 15, 16, 17 a game, close to double figure rebounds, a couple blocks a game and be a go-to guy. Uh, that's something that we've not asked Donovan to do before. And it's the first time that at this level he'll have to do it. I'm talking junk until the game starts and I'm gonna talk junk the whole game. I know I'm gonna win. I'm that confident in my team, my guys. We're gonna be good. We have the best leadership. We have the, the, the better players, the better team, I would say. We may have individual players, but we have a better team. Six, 
Seed. I want to let you know, man, it was a great draft for you. Thank you. Did an amazing job, appreciate man. It, appreciate yeah, it. Appreciate you. Thanks for performing. You know, out appreciate there for you me. giving me a chance. No you know, I love this team. You know, hopefully appreciate next year, you know, we can do the same thing Let's again. Just switching it up uh, a little bit, you know, playing softball. Uh, our camaraderie is there and our chemistry is built that way. And, and that's why we're successful. Definitely want to be a leadership player, a player that brings it each and every day and just bring in whatever the team needs each and every day. Hassan Diaris played in winning programs everywhere he's been. Two years at Texas A&M and prior to that, Putnam Academy. I was transferring, transferring schools, uh, and I was deciding whether to come here or go to another school, and I ended up coming here and basically made the best decision I can make in my life. Hosh, you gotta get out quicker. Hosh, come here. We gotta apply what we talk about, right? Hi, thank you. Good job. He needed an injection of energy and enthusiasm that he plays with. And he showed that throughout the season last year. He's shown that all summer and he's put himself in a position to have a great senior year. I'm showing no emotion on your knees, show your devotion. My skin is black but golden. I'm not here for bragging, boasting. Ain't lying, I've been chosen. Mind is burning, hearts exploding. This is my magnet open. In order for us to win some games with him, a lot out of the house. You know, he's just talking. His energy's up, and you know, when his energy's up, I feel like he brings up the whole team. As we get into games and, and things of that nature, our energy has to be on 10 each and every day. You know, just as coach says, he's going to be on 10, so we have to match his intensity level and his energy level each and every day. Yeah, we need leadership from Hassan. Hassan's got a big personality. He's from Queens. He's got a lot of pop. And we, we lost a lot of pop in terms of personality, especially with Andre. We need to fill that void in terms of locker room presence. Guys with some swagger and some confidence, and Haas has got it. What's up, UConn fans? We vlogging right now. I'm with the guy, Tristan Newton. We're in the airport on our way to our gate. C-128, right? Yes, sir. Uh, we finna take out on a trip, man. We finna have fun. Let's go. The foreign tour was just amazing. I would say uh, it was a great time for our team to bond and gel together. Uh, we got a chance to, to know each other a little bit more um, out of the country, see uh, different things and, and beautiful things. Yeah, I mean, the foreign tour was a blast. Um, you know, to be able to go out of the country and you know see Europe. You know, Barcelona was was beautiful. Monte Carlo was insane. Yo, Stu, how you wearing pants, bro? You're in Europe. Enjoy the weather. Look at the view. We out here. We taking a walk with the game. Seeing what's going on. Beautiful sights to see. I'm really the next Gordon Ramsay. Yeah. Black Gordon Ramsay. The black dread and tatted Gordon Ramsay. Most players, you know, that play in college and beyond, you know, their best friendships are developed in college. And experiences like we had this summer going to Europe together helps foster that. Learning a new culture together away from the court is, is important because you're building those relationships and you're building a bond that can translate onto the court where you need to have each other's back. You know, and then also getting out and be able to compete against some people that you haven't competed against before. There's no scouting report, there's no film. Just gotta go out there and be ready to go in tough environments, which I thought was helpful as well. Chemistry is, is a big thing. You want to be able to trust and, and know your teammates, all of them from 1 through 12. 
you know, on the court there's going to be a lot of rough times and, you know, if the team's not together and the team's not tight, you know, through those rough times, you know, fall apart, you guys aren't going to be together. You're going to go through tough times during the course of the season. You're going to go through tough times during the course of a day or a week. The ability to stay together and believe and trust in each other, that your partner or your teammate or your brother is going to be there for you, he's going to have your back, he's going to call out the screen, he's going to make the extra pass, he's going to make the effort for you to cover for you when you're struggling. That's what team is all about.